Hey YouTubers, so we're here pouring a 14 by 40 slab today just to add on to this barn. It's gonna be, I don't know, I think it's gonna be like a post and beam kind of thing. This guy's gonna work on boats in here. We're just getting going. Concrete 6.30 this morning. You can see it's about 12, 14 inches thick on the edges. It's supposed to be six inches thick in the middle. We got wire mesh, rebar. We're ready to go. Bigger, bigger rocks, huh? Bigger rock, oh, yeah. Oh, that's right. You use the, Get that wire a little crank nice. as you go. Just You can use the corner of that, just nice and easy. Yeah. Really good. Yeah. Go right underneath that window. Yeah. Don't, don't, don't get too far on that. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder how far it goes. I feel like that's where it's being. I'll be grabbing another string to put it on there, Mike. Oh, well, I. Uh, we can probably stand down. Just take them out. If you can get that one out. Oh, jeez. Oh. Oh. Shut him off. Pull them ahead and just go a little bit your way there. You drag that over there. Going ahead a little bit, just a little bit. That's a good game. You guys almost just kind of let it build up in a pile and then. No, we're just watching you work, buddy. Hey, no, I love it. There's only one play I can agree with, Mike. Yeah. I still want to bump you out of the way. I'm trying to work on lax. Lax? A lax. There's a lax. You don't know why we love what you think lax are. <laughs> I'll pull it this way. Hold on. Oh, look at that cow. Now I'll leave it on for a minute so we can get one more up there. See you on the board yet, Joe? Not yet. Here's the mother's day. That cool look, I just kept fighting with uh, the right there, Why do they always flip the wrong way? There I was, can you keep it constant? You're gonna grab that seat down.
Get a little bit right there, then I'll pull it more. Yeah. Probably could get him a lot closer. Get a little bit there and we'll re retool him. Right there where you're standing, yeah. Hi right, Tim. Put that wire up in front of the gate, right? Yeah. Better build up off. Yeah, it's got to go out hitting on something. Yeah, a little bit more right there, a little bit low. You want Luke to do it? I'll, I'll get it. He'll get it. Yeah, I was trying to get it flushed without splashing the boards too bad, but... I wouldn't worry much about the boards. I would say, you see how you're a little bit low there? Yeah. Like, if you put that on there... Yeah, I would... Do you like, normally run it Like, see how that is right there? Yeah. This is how I would do it. If it's if it's fluffed up a little bit already, I would just rough, rough mag it like that first. See how that fills that in nice? Yeah. And then if you feel like it's a little fluffed up still, now I would pull it back like that. It's kind of settled on its own. Yeah, and then just one more like that, boom, and you're done. You look like you're a little bit low still. Yeah, right there. Yeah. I'm 
No, that's good. That'd be alright. Alright. If you think about that, that screed as like a four foot level, you're trying to keep it level with him. So if, if you lift your end up, it, yeah. it makes him dig into his side. So as you're learning, just keep that in mind. Like, try not to be like, uh oh, uh oh. Just guide it on. Just try to keep it at an even plane with Darren if you can. We know, we know it's not going to be perfect. Get my feet out of the mud. I'm gonna get a little bit right behind you, Joe. I'm trying to. Slow it down. Is there a nail there somewhere, Joe? Thought I could shoot a pad with a laser. Careful you don't you don't lift that chute and hit your hand. Oh yeah. Yeah, just keep going. So all the way till we get up to here. Yeah. All right. All right, I'm gonna pull him ahead a little bit. Uh, You're going all the way back there, Joe. Yep. Right. Can you, me a favor, can you pull that last? Yep. Yeah. A little bit low right there. It's like six and a half, seven. Seems a little bit more creepy. It does, yeah. Yeah, it's probably like seven. I mean, I like it. It's easier to work with. I'm going to stop filling it this way. You should probably pull that kicker if you want. Just in case he runs out in the corner. Pull it that way? No, you're still good. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even 
Good. I think he's gonna do it. I'm gonna hold him up. We'll straight edge that down. Now he was like, you know what I'm thinking. And I'm like, it didn't well. look good. He wasn't even halfway. Ready, Joe? Be over there magging edges trying to get out of straight edging. Oh, what's this thing here? <laughs> All right, so you're just going to lightly ride that pad, and I'm going to... I'm gonna shrink this down a little bit. Okay. Stay on the side here. I'm not coming out. No. Don't go any further than the mag, Mark. Okay. All right. Now, what I, here's how I start. Okay. As soon as you feel the guy grab it, we always pick it up real just a little bit. No, nope, no. Nope. Pick it up. Break it. And then we stop back. And then we go. That's how I do it. So you're putting the front edge down just a little bit. To start, and then for many buddy oh. So yeah, only four inches, three or four inches makes me dig in, right? Yep. Yeah, so what was you asking? Like I'm not, I'm not digging the front, right? I'm just pick it up, set it back in. Yep, exactly. Exactly. So hold on a sec. Yep. Both these get all the drops that were there and find two more new ones. Alright. The best thing is to try to follow. Hopefully he gets a big swing. So until you feel him get that viewpoint. So we're gonna pick it up and then we're gonna set back and go. Perfect. Oh I'll go back. I hate it. Pretty good right there, Joe. Good. All right. A little dig in over here. But it's okay. All right. Well, down. Now you got the inside. All right. <laughs> Who's over there with him? You or Darren? Oh, Darren. <laughs> All right. Slow and easy. Step up. Step up. See where it is. Yep. Right up to about where this mark is oh, here. Okay. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. I'm following you. Just, just like that. Okay, hold on just a sec. Okay, put it down. Okay, now start like this, okay? Put your right foot back. Now what we're going to do is we're going to pick it up, set back. Pick it up. Set back. Pull towards you. Okay, so now, now when we stop and go to set back, look, bring your right foot up. There you go, and you're going to fill that hole in. Okay? There you go. And then back. Now left foot, kick. Oh. All right. Right foot, kick. Yeah. Left foot, kick. All right. Now good. Now hold on just a sec. Now are you? Yeah, I was gonna say. So all at the same time, you got to make sure you're scoring. And see how Darren's been scoring yep. with that line he leaves. You, all at the same time you're kicking all this, you got to make sure you're scoring. So it's like putting a whole dance together. Oh, yeah. So uh, let's bad. let's try a couple more. Let's set back, try a couple more. Right. And then I'll let Darren and Luke help me get down a little further. Yeah. And then you'll jump on it again, okay? Okay, easy enough. So get back to where, get back to where you scored, yeah. We're going to go right foot kick, left foot kick, okay? Right. right foot back. Here you go. Yeah. You good? Yeah. Push it down a little harder, you're not scoring. Right. Nope. Nope. Darren will tell you when. Yeah. yeah. Kick. Nope. Kick. <laughs> yeah, definitely the kicking chicken. There's a there's an art to it. Oh yeah, there is. Alright. Keep the rod low when you do it. Go back. Okay, good, good for a second. Good for a second. Yeah, still a little low, but Darren, grab that just for a minute. Now we'll go over it real quick. Yeah. Oh come on, that's what I learned on. 
Luke on the fourth quarter. Luke, is it easy to run on the board? What? They get the kicking in there. Maybe the pool deck tomorrow on the thin side? Yeah. yeah. They get the kicking in there. Oh, the kicking, that's... Because you kind of get a rhythm of your own, and then you start following that. what? Yeah. Good. Steve, he called you and asked you to go on the five home? <laughs> Not yet. No, he called me. He came for his office, but he came to the store. He didn't have to. He didn't have to. This is a little harder kicking in this thick concrete too, Joe, versus four inch concrete. Yeah. It's a little harder. I mean, just trying to get the how we doing there? Dig in angle. Oh, I see. You want to jump outside? I see. <laughs> see we'll go home, watch videos, and just shatter. see how he is. Watch him. He's gonna get outside. Nope. Get outside. Why would I get outside? I gotta jump back in. What are you gonna jump back in for? Actually, that'd be good. Let Joe screed outside on the board. Yeah, yeah, that'll give you the rhythm. Show him how to do it first. Luke, go ahead. Jump right out there for a minute with Luke, Joe. Yeah, he's probably not going to use his mag. Yeah. Just show him, show him how to hold it with two hands. Yeah. There you go. Just like that, Joe. You're riding the board, and you want, you want to kind of keep it back a little bit. And you're, yeah, and you're just slowly moving backwards too as you go. All right, pick it up, break it. There you go. Just a little bit, please, Tim. Coming behind you, Luke. Again, that's a dance of science and art. You were a long time. That's what I say. When you guys say, I just move your feet, I'm like, I feel like I am. And I look down, my feet aren't even moving. I feel like I'm standing in concrete. On some days, our feet barely move, too. Yeah, it's definitely just a little shuffle. Good. Big pile back, don't need to kick. It doesn't fill in, right? That's all the three things you watch for when you're scoring. Your high or low, and your feet, how much you need to pick up that hole. I'm going to scrape a little down, Tim. I just need that shovel. Thank you. They got two trucks there running, no lights on them. <laughs> this has happened. All right, they, cleaned, right on they cleaned the battery cables. That is all good. Everybody waiting on you, big guy. Let's go. Oh, let's go. That's a baby one. Baby three? No, baby four. Right. I'm gonna get my boot out, okay? Okay. Good. Bring it right down. Nice. 
Yeah. Could probably use a kicker here. What did, what did he say about the ankle bolt? Oh, just one here, one there, one there. Oh, okay. Just in between them. I'll grab a kicker mic. Maybe one right here, yeah. Here, let's help me push this in on this kicker. Ready? Yeah. That's pretty good there now. Boy, that ain't bad. I'd leave it. How's the rest of it, you think? Okay? It ain't horrible. Yeah. Not too bad. You'll dry up. Luke will get the fan. Oh no, it's no fans in the truck. Natural. Yeah, wait until I get them all. Ah, there. Yeah. That went pretty good. 19 yards of concrete in that little slab. It's pretty thick. So from here, we'll leave a couple guys here to finish. Teaching Joe how to finish. So Joe, Joe's from Ohio. Retired military, 23 years in the Air Force. Wanted to learn how to do concrete after he retired. So he, he drove up here to Maine. Gonna, <laughs> gonna spend about a month with us. And we're trying to teach him, you know, the ins and outs of concrete. So he's slowly learning, you know, bow float and screed and magging edges. He got to run a power trial a little bit yesterday. He'll get to run a power trial a little bit today. And, you know, hopefully by the end of four weeks, he's got a, a pretty good idea about, you know, what to do with concrete. At least get started. He's going to start his own business out in Ohio. You know, if I have to go out there and help him a little bit, I'll drive, I'll travel out to Ohio and help him a little bit just to get going. But it's, it's pretty cool. So we'll leave Luke and uh, Joe here. Me and Darren are gonna head to a pool deck that we're gonna do tomorrow. So you get to see a nice broom finished pool deck. We got a little bit of setup left to do. Not much though. We got all the forms up and ready to go. We gotta put some wire in there. We got some trench drain we're gonna put up against the house. Just get that all ready for tomorrow. So when we show up early tomorrow morning, we don't have to do anything. All right, so that's gonna do it for here today. Catch you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching. All right, so this is a sneak look inside the concrete underground where I have multiple trainings, multiple different categories on how I teach you how to pour and finish concrete, how to repair concrete, how to do epoxy coatings. There's just multiple different trainings where I go in depth and teach you how to do all this stuff.